previously on The Walking Dead. While searching for a place to call home, AJ and I found an old boarding school run by kids deep in the forest. Their leader was a guy named Marlin, and AJ pulled the trigger. I told AJ that what he'd done was murder, that he'd have to atone for it. The other kids agreed. They voted to kick us out. I thought we'd never return. Then, AJ and I were attacked by Abel, one of the raiders Marlin had given the twins to. He was with someone I thought I'd never see again. Lily. We were almost eaten by walkers when suddenly one of them spoke to me. His name was James, an ex-whisperer who didn't believe in killing walkers. He helped me treat AJ, but without real medicine, he wouldn't make it. The kids didn't turn away the sad sight of AJ and let us back inside. After I told them how we could defend the school against the raiders, they were willing to let us stay, at least until the fight. I decided to help Lewis tune his piano. He opened up to me, and I admitted I had feelings for him. He had the same ones. Then the raiders finally came. They busted open our gates, but the kids stayed hidden as planned. Until Ten ran out of cover, hoping for a chance to learn about his missing sisters. The bomb went off, and attempting to save Ten, Mitch threw himself at Lily and got a knife to the throat. With only a second to decide, I fired and saved Lewis. They got away with three of our friends, and we had no idea where they'd gone. But we knew someone who did. We're finally back. I guess I should be grateful for at least that, considering I didn't even know if we would have closure in this story. But considering where we're picking things up from, it's hard to be cheerful about anything. Sometimes, but he was always nice to me. Now he's gone. Stabbed in the eye by some asshole who never even knew his name. Mitch was looking after all of us. He gave his life so we could go on fighting. I know that. Doesn't make it any easier. He'd want us to find our friends and bring them home safe. And he'd want us to kill the people who took them. Abel's tied up in the basement. He passed out from the pain. Thanks. AJ wanted to stay down there and keep an eye on him. Hey, buddy. It's time for us to bury Mitch and say our goodbyes. I'll help you Get carry. away from him! You're the reason he's dead! We could not be fighting each other really? right now. Well, it's true! We had a plan, and that idiot messed it up! Come on, Willie. None of this is Ten's fault. You know who's really to blame. I can't believe you're defending him! This... This is bullshit! Ten! Let me handle this. Talk to Abel. See if you can't find out where Lily took Vi, Omar, and Asim. I wanted to hurt him, you know, to make him talk, but... I just couldn't. Maybe you'll get more out of him than I did. Thanks for sticking by me. <sighs> okay, jackhole. Time to talk. I've just about lost my patience. 
I'll do but basically pulling out all the stuff. If you saw my image show in LP, you remember that interrogation segment. Prepare to see some of that come back because I am not having it. But I am having a second to look around. Oh look, we can collect things for our room in this dreary time. Okay, we got Erickson's pennant. School pride. Uh, anything else? We get that brick. Only a very few amount of people get that reference. Yeah, just a brick. What a great reference, but it is a great reference. But you guys don't get to know about it. So I'm just making this super awkward with commentary wise because none of you know what I'm talking about. Ooh, could we get duct tape for our room? Be strong enough to hold him. Could it remind us of duck? No. Uh, let's see, got anything else? Anything that's gonna stand out? Oh, he's right there. H. Oh, Rosie. Hey, buddy. You'll protect us if anything goes wrong, right? Oh, I am not prepared for this dog to die. I just got... She's my dog now. Oh my god, you have Rosie. I just got back from seeing a dog's way home, and oh my god, I'm sick of stinking animal cruelty. Like, if that happens in this episode, my god, I am... I'm just gone. And oh my god, it seems so long ago Brody was a member of the group. Oh my god, that's when everything fell apart. But then again, maybe it already fallen apart, and... They just tried to cover it all up. Is that an Etch-a-Sketch? A uh, sketch toy might still work. It even works! Kinda where you got two of the collectibles in the first area. Maybe there are like a bunch of them this time around, or maybe there's just not a lot of room for free range walking and stuff. Guess we'll find out. Here's AJ. Dude, he looks so stinking cool. serious. Uh -huh. Ready? Uh, let AJ wake him? I feel like he's gonna shoot his foot or something. Mind if I slap you a question? <laughs> the fuck? Well, that ain't no way to wake an old man up from his afternoon nap. I was having a nice dream, too. About a girl I used to know from before. She also had me tied up, but I wasn't her prisoner if you get my meaning. Hilarious. <laughs> Got any water? Not for you. Drink. Okay. I think I get a say in the matter. You got good manners, Squirt? Don't mind if I do. <laughs> You've had your water. Now it's time to talk. It's the first time interrogating someone, isn't it? <laughs> you let me dictate the agenda. Makes me think Great! Oh, fine, last time I'm gonna let you have your way then. It needs to be, okay? I just wanna know where Lily is. She's trying to start things off people. nice, but no. It doesn't matter. As soon as she gets there, she's gonna turn around and come right back for me. <laughs> you better give me the five-star treatment. If I'm smiling, Ooh, I can already do that. Mm. You might be able to trade me for a little mercy. We underestimated. I don't want him to get mad at Rosie, though. That's why I, I'm, I don't want to sick Rosie right now because I don't want him to go after her or have a She'll reason be to. She'll back. Trust me. She can't afford to leave anyone behind. <laughs> Jesus! <laughs> the fuck is wrong with you? That ain't five star. Tell us where that ain't five our star. Or she'll do it again. <laughs> Lily will never give him up. The only reason we came here was for more manpower. Losing Jonathan and me, three sprouts that can barely hold a gun. <sighs> Even a dummy like me can do the math on that one. We're gonna get him back. You don't know what it's like out there. It's a bloodbath. One community against another. From Richmond to the coast. 
Back in the Delta Rich World Wait a minute, War, what? With some really sick fucks who make me look like the Virgin Mary. We're not going back there, are we? We need people to fight it. Soldiers who do what we say. Point the guns the way we tell them to. You little turds are supposed to be easy pickings. No fucking way I'd let my people fight for you. I'm starting to think you're mad at me. You think we like doing raids like this? Our home is under threat. It's a good home. Built to last. I'd do a lot to protect it. Maybe you can understand that. And I do a lot to get my friends back. So stop wasting my time. Okay. Front pocket. The answer to all your questions. Oh boy. Read it. <sighs> Whatsoever parteth the hoof and is cloven footed, and cheweth the cud among the beasts that shall ye eat. What the fuck? Is this code? No, it's fucking Leviticus. I was hoping it'd be some timely, moralistic shit about turning the other cheek. What? Well, come on. That thing ain't gonna light itself. Wanna know where your friends are? The smoke will clear my mind. But you just told me not to let you leave this guy. Oh! Oh wait, I'm gonna burn him possibly. Help me remember stuff. Is the crotch an option? Like uh. Come on, kid. Don't make me wait all day. God darn it. <laughs> he warned me about leading the conversation. Mm. Uh, phooey. He's not someone I could trust. He's never gonna be on our side. That's not a thing. So why am I considering letting him smoke? He doesn't have a... Oh, uh, we'll just stick it in his mouth then? I don't know, maybe he'll choke on it. Maybe that'll be fun. Burn him though, that's... Uh, <sighs> why am I hesitant on this? Because I don't have a time limit, so... Please, AJ, just take it from me and do what you want to do. Mm. God darn it. But the fact that they were like, consider your option before choosing. Oh, yeah. Strike two. Fool me once, shame on you. Fool me twice. <laughs> and besides, smoking kills him in a different way, so we're fine. Oh wait, 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 wait! Oh, maybe I should have burned him. Maybe I should have burned him. Maybe I wait. Maybe he's That's trying to kill himself so he won't be able to talk. This is not good. Oh no! Did I seriously mess up by giving him that? He's gonna die, isn't he? Uh... Isn't that what you wanted? I did, but... Oh, I didn't think I was talking to AJ. Oh, god darn it. your wish. When you pushed me off that balcony, something must have burst inside of me. I didn't even consider that. That's never happened before. I never god darn it. Like this. Everything. It's a different scenario. Oh, no. It all got out of hand. Now look at me. I'm a fucking mess. Yeah, you sure are. So try and do Return. one decent thing, no. Will, before you go. <laughs> my, my whole life. I didn't just kill him, did everything I? Everything I ever got, I got with my own two hands. One and hand. My will. <laughs> I'm sorry. For my body to turn on me, to take control. I'll tell you where to find Lily. Just promise. You won't let me turn. Fine, deal. I'll still kill you if you die, but I won't let you turn. Let him sweat. If you're honest with me, I'll put you out of your misery. You have my word. 
Okay, we have a boat. We're docked a few miles west of here at an old fishing pier. Your friends are on the boat. <laughs> you, you got what you wanted. Please, don't let me become one of those things. Wow, I didn't think you'd break like this. Please. I don't, I don't believe in getting some sort of sick and twisted revenge after he's already gone. I, I have no problem with killing him now. We got what we needed. Let's just do it. Not that. I wanna let me keep What do you want? The crotch then? Wait, no, you need to No, that's not how turning works. You don't need to watch this. I want to. Oh, god darn it. You said you want to keep- oh wait, okay. I guess you just didn't want his head to blow up. Alright, whatever. Thanks for the help. Now it's over. It would be real awkward if he was lying. And if we could have kept him alive, if, would burning him keep At him alive? I don't think so. He, he's, yeah. he smoked once and that blew him up. You just tortured a man from- WHAT DID YOU WANT ME TO DO THOUGH?! Ugh. Slamming his head, his head down, I could have sicked the dog on him. A boat to find. Oh, no, 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 stop taking it in, AJ, stop it! Don't you get any crazy ideas! We're on a rescue mission and we need everyone to be level-headed. Oh, hi, Skybound. Thanks for saving the franchise. Oh, <sighs> Alright then, we are on our way to saving our friends. Good morning, everybody, it's Midnight and Beyond, welcoming you back to the world of The Walking Dead, the final season. I can't stress enough just how grateful I am that I could even say that. We are really back. Thank you so much to Skybound Entertainment for picking up this game and getting as many of the original workers on it back on this project and seeing it through to the end. This wouldn't be possible without you. I wish it was being finished under happier circumstances, but we'll be able to see this legendary franchise come to the ending it was hopefully destined to go to. If the creators had finished it without any uh, roadblocks in the way. I am absolutely terrified of where things will head uh, throughout these last two episodes, but just like everything else, we just gotta keep on pushing through it and see it, see all of our choices to the end. So let's go. Oh, AJ, like, just. Please, please ask permission before you do anything. That's all I ask. This is the entire Once group now. This is we sad. A way to sneak oh my on God. Board. Yeah, if Ten doesn't fuck it up this time. Dude, you need to chill. It wasn't Ten's fault. Yes, it was. Mitch died because he. Say one more thing about Ten. I dare you. Guys, there it is. Oh, and Lewis is shot. I really hope that doesn't come back later. I hope it's just a visual thing and like he doesn't like become actually weaker in the story because of that. Because that's my fault! Ugh. Here we are. It's not their camp though, is it? This is just like a transport system? You see anything? The beach, um, a boat, and a, a wood street in the water. It's called wood a pier. Street. It's hmm. called a pier. Okay. A wood street. Oh wait, I thought it was like a name nice. of a street, but no, Keep it's a Okay, it's funny. Do I talk? Spy on the raiders. Oh god. Well, they got those corners. AJ is gone. That's always a great sign. Hey, buddy. Have you ever seen this thing before? No way. Pretty sure I would have remembered an old-timey riverboat. And from where I'm sitting, looks like that pier is the only way inside. Well, let's see what else is down there. Uh, what? Well, there's a person. Can't examine them. I can see an entrance. 
Yeah. There's one at the other end of the boat, too. There's a small opening at the top of those closed doorways. AJ and I know how to deal with those. Intel small opening. AJ sized. Great. I don't see any obvious place to keep prisoners. Don't boats have brigs? Boat jails. Maybe. Boat but jails. Where? Now that, I, I, I don't know. It's usually below deck, isn't it? The pier has plenty of cover on it. If we're careful, we can sneak in undetected. Hmm. There are a few on deck. A couple others on the pier. Could be more inside. Wait, I see Violet. Holy oh shit. no. This is really it. We found them. Yeah, they're already inside and being put away. Um, there's a path. There's no good cover leading up to the boat. We're gonna need one hell of a distraction. Walker! Walkers are good distractions. Oh, you're not suggest. No, we can't dress up as them. I was thinking maybe we pulled James, but they're not gonna hesitate to shoot. Now we just need what a dozen walkers. How hard could that be? Maybe not as hard as you'd think. Maybe my idea is not entirely crazy. Come on, we talk to everyone else. All right, Willie, we need you to be level-headed for this. I know you're mad, but anything useful? Looks like building material, furniture. Probably stuff from the train station. Make a plan. Sheet metal, wood, and quite a bit of it. We should have that stuff. Huh. Are those torches? Maybe. Why? We could use the fire. Burn this place to the ground? Yeah, that won't make him mad. Let's see, anything else? I think they actually have the dots for things that we need to examine. It makes I'm it easier to find them. Supplies. I could cut those loose and just ride them down river. Easy. Will we be getting them afterwards, or are you just like making them switch their priorities if we distract them with that? We're not here to steal supplies. We're here to save our friends. Oh, uh, where's AJ? I saw him somewhere before. There he is. Find anything over here? They have horses. Let me see. More torches. Okay, Setting the hay that was necessary. Get their attention. Scare the horses too. We could get on the boat easier that way. Uh Poor horses, I don't want them to get hurt. If we cut those horses free, we could slow down anyone trying to chase us. Oh, please don't make me hurt the horses. I'm just sending them free, nothing else. We should get out of here before they spot us. We can talk through the plan once we're somewhere safe. I was hoping for a loading screen. I was gonna be like, okay, but not sure if we're safe yet. As long as we're outside. All right. Oh god. What's the plan? Well, they've got guards posted on the pier and the boat. There's no way we can take them all at once. Our only hope is to distract them while we sneak on board. We should burn their stuff. That'd work. We could burn the supplies or the hay they keep for the horses. Whatever we don't burn, we should take. That's not a priority. Ruby would love to have the horses. But I'd rather steal those supplies. I could build traps. Weapons. I want to burn yeah, the supplies. We'll steal their supplies and burn the hay as our distraction. If, if we get greedy, it's going to slow us down. Do it carefully. Wouldn't do it any other way. The fire will lure the raiders away uh, from the boat, and we can sneak across the pier. I really hope this doesn't end up slowing me down and getting someone shoot. killed. You remember that guy I told you about, James? He sent in walkers to save us from Lily and Abel. 
Maybe we could convince him to do it again. If we lead a big enough group of them onto the beach, we can blend in without being seen. You know, he's sort of a pacifist, though. I don't know if he'd do it. Well, hell yeah. Let's find out how much he charges for his services. He charges. What about after we get everyone home? I mean, I don't know. He Chuck E. Cheese. Come attack us again. What then? Oh, yeah, that. Oh, geez. Hide, quick. Oh, no. Who is it? Generic? Oh, geez. Go. Which, which stick is the it's left stick for movement, right? Or does it not matter? I'm just always going to use both sticks. Who is it? A okay, come look at your pain. Be. You all stay here. I'll see if they know anything that could help us. What, you think it's a stranger? Like someone new? Interrogate Raider. Drop it. How many of you are there? How many of who? I'm not fucking around. Answer the question. Eight. There's eight. Clem, stop! Oh. Hey, Minnie. What? After the attack, I wasn't sure. I mean, I heard they burned half your school down. Who survived? Ruby? Mitch? Brody? Ten? Ruby and Ten made it. Mitch didn't. And Brody, um, she died. Ted's boots holding up okay? His boots? They're so old, they're more holes than rubber. I duct taped him up the last time I saw him, but that was a while ago. His boots are fine. You're Clementine. The girl who took over after Marlin died. Oh, she yeah. doesn't like us. I thought everyone would want to lean on their own. Not the new kid. Yeah, I'm in charge. What a freaking fantastic job you've done. Excuse me. Oh boy. She probably doesn't like that got Violet kidnapped. April figure I was thinking about that, honestly, that. Went over like he and Lily did, but if Lily was telling the truth like about her being alive, I thought she was lying. The whole but are you with them? So like, would Violet want to be with you about? still? And could you help us? You so but of course you're gonna hate us because you're gonna blame us for yeah, all that. Okay, all that makes sense to have a new person Marlin do it. Would have never made them fight the way you did. He wouldn't have Marlin killed, killed Brody. Him. Are you aware of that? That is some grade A horse shit. Clem saved us. Yeah. And how come so many people are dead? He wouldn't have gotten people killed. He murdered Brody. What? She didn't know. Okay, that might Minerva? tone her down a bit. Where's Sophie? She... She died protecting the Delta. A hero. I'm har I'm sorry. A hero? God, you... Minerva! Shit. Oh, jeez. You gonna help us? Down? Is that Lily? Talking him! Finish up and head back. I want to be Is that in her nickname? Dark. Rockingham? Oh, don't rat us out. Don't you dare rat us out. Yes, ma'am. Thank you. We're gonna have to fight for her loyalty. And her trust. I just hope it's an option. Our boat leaves for the Delta in two days. Then it'll be a couple of weeks before we can come back for the rest of you. When we do, don't fight. The only way you're gonna save your people is to let us take them. I'm serious. Don't fight this. If Ten could see you now, he'd be ashamed to call you his sister. I feel like we could reason with her if we could just get through to her, but 
was not expecting that sort of reunion. Are you okay? She's not being held prisoner. It doesn't change. It seems anything. like she's here of her own free will. And... We still have to get onto that boat. You all should head home. Start getting things ready. Get everyone caught up on the plan. Everyone except Ten. I warned you. Enough. Both of you. AJ and I will go find James. Be safe. Well, obviously wasn't taken there of her free will, but like she's content with her position now and Violet's in her vicinity now and she's okay with it? Maybe she's just gonna try and convince her to be okay with it? Oh my god.